What's going on, everybody? What's up, guys? Tyler and Remy here from Team Cough. <coughs> and today, we're fishing the Roaring Fork River. It's a pretty nice cold day. It's been really warm up here on the western slope. It's been like mid 60s for the last few weeks, all of November. It's late November right now. And we're finally getting some snow, which means less people on the river and also incoming ice fishing. So today we got about half a day, the second half of the day right now. It's about two o'clock. We're gonna see how many fish we can get out of here. All right, so stay tuned and hopefully we can get some. Oh, popped off. Brown. Brown? Yep. All right, move down. Remy's over to the left of me by the bridge. I'm gonna be right here. Sort of where he just was. Going. Oh, he came off, shoot. There's a little brown. Bummer. That's a bad luck lately with these fish coming off. Ooh, had a bite. Yeah, he was on it for a second. Got one. Nice. So brown. Yep. Whew. All right, guys. Well, finally got the skunk out. Thank goodness. Really nice colors on this one, though. Ooh, look at that, guys. Really nice colors. Gorgeous brown. All right, well, that was pretty sweet, guys. Let's see if we can get another one out of this pool here. The real question is, is where do you want to ice fish tomorrow? I'm down for the mace. I don't have any practice or anything. I'm down to leave early. All right, well, I got to do some retying on. All right. Back again after some break-offs. We're going to be throwing the... HD Ghostman. I don't know if this is the right choice or not. I still haven't really dialed in when to throw this and when not to. Some days it works out really well for me. Some days it doesn't catch me anything. So I always just try to give it a, give it a whirl and try to kind of pay attention to what the conditions are like. Typically though, when it's super ultra clear water, I don't really get super good results with this. That's kind of what this water is right now. So we'll see what we can get. If this doesn't work, I'll probably throw on another HD Brown and try that out. Move down right here. This is, I guess, technically the fork. You know, so here's the fork on the right. There's the Colorado on the left. Okay. So, I mean, we're kind of in both. We're not going to move too much down since we told you guys this would be an episode on the fork and we kind of want to stay on the fork. So, we probably, where Remy is right there, probably won't move too much further past that point. There's obviously a lot of other spots that we can hit on this river. It's just that we only have a half day to fish and we've only been fishing for about three quarters of the time that, we're, that we got. So it's been a pretty nippy day, but just cause it's cold doesn't mean you can't get the trout out of here. Just gotta bear it with the numb hands and stuff for a little bit. 
Oh, oh, shoot, I had one. Got one. brown action oh yeah we're getting bigger guys yeah look at that what's up guys what's going on remy and tyler here pretty decent half day you know pulled in a bunch of brown trout here on the fork not bad not not bad, but man, it is freezing. That's someone behind that mountain behind us there, and it's probably dropped like 10 degrees. It's probably about like, oh, 12 degrees right now, 13 degrees. Oh, yeah, it's getting down there. Yeah, so, oh, it was a pretty fun day overall though. Always having fun on the river. Oh, yeah. Guys, we're gonna be doing a lot of ice fishing coming up here. <laughs> um, the next couple days, me, Remy, Sam, all of us, we're gonna be hitting different bodies of water, searching for that ice, okay? So for the new subscribers that are here to the channel during the winter time, we're gonna be doing ice fishing and we're gonna be doing river fishing, a little bit of both, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like the video if you guys did, subscribe to the channel. Really appreciate the support. Until next time guys, yep. Team Costa and out. Guys, man.